Hi there, mini trucks. And what are you doing? We're just tidying up. After last night's hurricane, the yard is such a huge mess, as you can see. <laughs> Making a pile is not exactly the best method for tidying up. I have the perfect mission for you. Everyone to truck control! Yeah! Yeah! Dear Mini Truck, as you know, the hurricane has affected the whole area of Truckville, and Amy, the mechanic's workshop, has been turned upside down. Oh no, but what is she gonna do for her clients who need her? Exactly. You are going to help clear up all the tools that have been thrown around by the hurricane. So then, I will equip you with the mechanical arm modules and send you off to her workshop. Woohoo! Okay, so here we go to Amy's rescue! Are you ready, Mini Trucks? Yes! yes. Four, three, two, one, mini trucks, go! Oh, 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 oh. Hello there, mini trucks. Hello, Amy. Oh, it's so true that the hurricane has really messed up all your tools. Yes, I know. And my next client arrives in 10 minutes. I can't have them come to my workshop with this mess. Are you ready to help me tidy it up? Yes! yes. <laughs> no, not like that, Alice. So that I can work properly, all my tools must be in their respective storing place. This box contains screwdrivers, this one contains hammers, and this one nuts and bolts. Oh. Now your turn. Okay, let's do this! should be put in their proper places. Oh no, we're gonna have to redo it all. But we're never gonna finish on time. I might just have a plan, but we must work together as a team. Okay, this is what we're gonna do, guys. Is everyone in place? Yup. Me too, I'm ready. Amy, how much longer do we have? 20 seconds. Okay, mini trucks, go! Hammers and nuts, screwdrivers, Screwdrivers, more nuts, hammers, screwdrivers, hammers, and nuts, and nuts, more nuts, screwdrivers, hammers. Come on, you all, we must hurry up. Now watch out, mini trucks. Quick, Jeremy. Quick. Five, hammer, screwdriver, four, and nuts, three, hammer, two, screwdriver, one, all finished! Yay! All, all finished. finished! Wow! It's all put away! We make such a great team! Yep, that's for sure! Thank you! My workshop is now perfectly tidy! That was close! Here's the first client! Grandpa Ted! Wow! Hey, mini trucks! I say this is some great tidying up you've done here! I could not have done better! I'm so proud of you, and because of your work, you deserve the Spring Clean Cup. We will need to put this... Oh, watch out, Mini Trucks. Have you ever seen this road sign before? A what sign? That big red stop sign. We've just avoided a collision here. You must respect the highway code at all times. 
the highway code, but what's that? There are rules to follow in driving on the road. By doing this, it avoids unnecessary accidents. And I know exactly who can teach you. Everyone to truck control! Woohoo! Dear Minitruck, your new mission of the day is to learn the safe highway code. I bet it's pretty easy. Hey, not so fast. Put on your helmets and head for downtown. <laughs> Tony Truck is waiting. Yippee! Mini trucks. Are you ready to discover the secrets of the highway code? Yes! I've set up a course for you to follow, so the goal is to finish without having an accident. That's easy! <laughs> Three, two, one, and oh, you're up! Power! Hey! Oh! Hey! 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 We didn't succeed. I don't understand. I was going so fast. <laughs> Alex, the aim is not to go fast, but to arrive without having an accident. Do you have any idea what went wrong back there? Maybe we just weren't aware of the road signs. Exactly right. You must follow all of the road signs. For example, when you see a stop sign, you must stop for three seconds and look right, and then look left to see if anybody's coming, and you must wait for them. Say no more! Three, two, one, go! Thank you, Alex. You're welcome. This stop sign is for me, so I'm gonna stop. Thank you, Jeremy. Yippee! Hey, now that's a funny looking stop sign there. But it's different, so I think I can still go. Hey, I don't know this road sign. But that big arrow seems to tell me that I can go. Oh, no! What do we do now? Do you go backwards or do I? What sort of sign did you have on your side? Uh, it was a big red circle with a white line across it. And you? A big white arrow on a blue background. That big red sign means no entry. It's an important sign to understand. It indicates that you can't take that road. Whereas the sign which has the big white arrow in the blue background says it's a one-way street. It's also important to know. It indicates that the road can only be taken in one direction. Then I'll just back up then. So this time, no errors. We must follow the blue sign with the white arrow. Oh yeah, we're gonna make it through this challenge in no time. Calculating trajectory. So let's go. Hey, what are you doing, Lisa? But you are the one going the wrong way, Alex. Tony, can you help us, please? We can't agree on this one. Alex and Lisa. In roundabouts, the rule is quite simple, as indicated on the road signs that you have just passed. You must always go in an anti-clockwise direction, and be sure to pay attention to who has the right of way. Hmm. Now, it is your turn to try. All right, we did it! We arrived at the same time! And without any accidents! Well, nearly! <laughs> I'm glad to say that you can all drive safely. Bravo, hmm? Mini Trucks! For hmm? your work, you have earned the Highway Code Trophy! Yes! And now we will never go the wrong way again! <laughs> <laughs> and boom! I scored! Oh man, if the bucket had been further away, I would have scored! Bullseye! No bucket out there can escape me! Woohoo! I got it in! Oh, that's cheating, Alice, because you were closer! Not at all! I just aim better than you! Hey there, young ones! Are you training out here today to become sharpshooters? But I don't need any training! <laughs> 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 
Even so, to be really good requires trying over and over again. Saying that, Tony Truck has organized a shooting competition, so it's your opportunity to test your skills. A shooting competition? Oh, yeah, uh -huh. let's do it. Okay, now everyone to truck control. Yippee! Yeah! Tony Truck's competition is divided into several shooting stands which will put you mini trucks to the test for precision. To take part, you will be equipped with a catapult module. Super! I just love catapults! I'm programming the launch pad to send you to the competition. It's up to you now! Yeah! Oh. It's gonna be so great! Four, three, two, one, mini truck, go! Hello, Tony Truck! I love your festival and what you've done for the competition! <laughs> Why, thanks, Silas. Chef Cookie gave me a hand in setting it up. Hello there, mini trucks! Now it's time to begin! You have one turn each and one turn on each stand. If you just hit the target, you'll score one point. And if you hit the target in the bowl, that means you get two points. Mm -hmm. Four points total, you will win a terrific prize. So mm -hmm. that means we need to make at least one perfect shot. Well calculated, Lisa. Okay, so the first part of the competition is to knock all the cones down. If you're able to do that successfully, you get two points. I will start. Wow, great shot. You got two points. Well done. My turn. I got a hit. That gives me one point. Ha, five out of six. I nearly did it. Yep, but it's still just worth one point. Yeah, yeah, I know. Huh? Oops, I think that was too hard. Let's move on to the next part. For this challenge, you will need to jump on this ramp and shoot the target over there from the air. Now be careful, though. If you shoot from the ground, you'll get no points and will be disqualified from no. the competition. Let me go first. Wow, wow, that was impressive. With my screen, I too shall get in the bowl. You'll see. Oh. Hmm. Too bad, Alice. You concentrated too hard on the target, so you forgot to pay attention to the ramp. You score zero points. Now, who's next? <gasps> yeah! That is two points, and so you have won the chance to go get the target to put it back. Oh, it's not funny shooting too hard. You can go now, Lisa. <sighs> just two more points and it's a wrap. I'm in the lead with three points already. I'm just too good. <laughs> and for this final challenge, you must shoot very far this time, but remember to focus. You need strength as well as precision to win this challenge. This time, no mistake is allowed. You can do it, Alice. If I hit the center, that means I beat Alex. Oh, now we're even. I guess that's good. My turn. Jeremy, you'll shoot last mm -hmm. just in case you break the target mm -hmm. again. Go, Lisa. You're the best shot. Hm. Awesome. Oh, yeah. Your turn, Jeremy. We're counting on you to succeed. Wow. wow. Yippee. Well done, well done. With four points each, you can all have a cuddly toy in the color of your choice. So go ahead and pick one for your prize. What a victory! I have made a special cake to celebrate. You do uh, really like cake, Chef Cookie. Grandpa Ted! I'm so proud of you mini trucks. Everyone here is a winner, and you all cheered each other along at crucial moments. For your teamwork, you all deserve the Shark Shooter's Cup. Jeremy, you must not aim at these cups since you might just break them. But only if he touches them. <laughs> hmm. uh -huh. hmm. The Star Defender is getting dangerously close to the goal. Alex, give me the ball. And he strikes the ball with such a sweet move. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's a goal. Wait, what? You could have passed it to me. You're playing solo and it's just not fun. Perhaps, but I never miss a goal. Yeah, you play as if we weren't there. Oops, I didn't even see you there, Jeremy. I'm sorry. You know, Alex, truck soccer's really a team game. Yeah, but I'm better when I play solo. Well, in 
that case, I believe I have a challenge for you, mini trucks. Now let's go to truck control. Dear mini trucks, your mission today will be to strike a goal against the incredible coach Zoe. <laughs> Striking a goal? Too easy. <laughs> Physical strength alone will not be sufficient, my dear Alex. Zoe is waiting for you now. Are you ready? Yeah, let's go! Four, three, two, one! Mini truck, go! Hi there, mini trucks. Ready to let off steam? But I'm not heating anything! <laughs> I was talking about letting off some excess energy, Alice. Here is the ball. To win the game, you just need to strike a goal by following the classic rules of truck soccer. Oh, we're really good at truck soccer. You'll see. And we're off! I'm so good, this will be done in just a few seconds. The amazing Alex is master of the kick. And just like that, you missed. But I couldn't even kick it. That's because you haven't even tried to avoid Zoe. By making zigzags along the way with the ball, it will work. The goal is mine! Go on, strike! Oh! You missed again. <laughs> Try not to despair, Mini Truck. It's my huh? turn! Mm -hmm. Alice, you're not allowed to shoot from your position. You're outside the limits of the pitch. If you don't go by the rules, your goal will not count. Oh, but I haven't even scored a goal. I have an idea. Lisa, follow me. And we're off. Your goal, Jeremy. <gasps> oh. We nearly had it! Well done, Jeremy. That was a good strategy. You have to practice making passes and you will succeed. I know how to help you. I'm going to try and take the ball from you. To stop me, you must make several passes before I arrive. Understood! Are you ready? Yeah! Throw me the ball! Woohoo! Pass it to me! Pass it to me! Oh. And there! Uh -huh. Jeremy, it's mm -hmm. yours! Look, I did it! Whew, it didn't pass too far! Bravo, many trucks! You've mastered the game by playing as a team, so why don't you try to strike a goal by using what you've just learned? Yeah! yeah. Watch out, because things are getting tough! We'll see how much power you've got now! Over to you, Jeremy! To you, Alex! This time, we're playing as a team! Lisa! Thanks to my special glasses, I really can't miss this goal! Goal! Wow! Right in! Thank you, Alex! No problem, Lisa! We make a really great team! Well done, Mini Trucks! I always knew you could do it! That was an incredible goal, Mini Trucks. I can see that Zoe has turned you into really good soccer truck players. More than that, I turned them into a real team, closely knit and efficient. Well, in that case, you have especially earned the lucky cup that's given for Soccer Cup. Hooray! Yippee! They're so pretty, these cups! On the other hand, you mustn't make passes with them, or you just might break them. <laughs> Coming to you, direct from the port of Nutmill. Our specialists have confirmed that the treasure of Pirate Sam must be lost somewhere in the deepest part of the sea. Oh my my, there's a lost treasure? Grandpa Ted, can we go in search of this lost treasure? Oh, oh yes, yes. Let, let, us let us go! Sure you can. But Mini Trucks, please promise me to be very careful, because the sea depths of Trucksville can be very scary. Now everyone to truck control! <laughs> yeah! Dear Mini Trucks, your brand new challenge and mission of the day is to find the lost treasure of Pirate Sam. He will help you on this adventure. Yeah, with 
help from Eve, nothing's impossible. I'm equipping you with submarine modules and I'm programming the launch pad. So now it will bid you farewell, mini truck. Here we go! Four, three, two, one, mini truck. Yeah! Hello, Eve! Hello there, Mini Trucks. How do you think you will find this treasure? By searching thoroughly everywhere, like in between the seaweed and behind every rock! Mini, Mini Trucks, disperse now! Oh! 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 The treasure! Oh no, it's just a rock. Keep on searching. I found nothing. And you? Nothing, nothing is, is here. here. I think there must be a mistake because we have been searching absolutely everywhere. Hmm, that means this treasure is very well hidden. I have an idea. We're going to use my sonar. Your, Your sonar? sonar? But what's that? It's an apparatus that's part of my submarine. It sends sound waves underwater and helps me to find objects. The faster it rings, the closer the object is. That's incredible. It's up to you. Please guide me. Let's see. Oh. Over there. Hmm. Yes! This must be the right direction! Oh! And now I feel we're getting closer! The treasure is ours! Super! I'll switch off my sonar. Who knows? It might be just under that rock! But it's so huge! We'll never budge that thing! In that case, let's try and push it together! Excellent idea, Jeremy! Hee-ho! Hee-ho! Look, we did it! Oh! Ah, oh, you've just found the entrance of the abyss. The abyss? But what's that? That's what we call the ocean when it gets very deep. Ah! The treasure chest must be at the bottom! It's getting really dark down here. We can't see anything. Then I'm switching on my infrared vision. It's a bit scary down here, don't you think? Grandpa Ted did warn us about that, Alice. That's it. I can see the treasure. Whoa! Wait, what's that? It's, it's a, a ghost! ghost! Oh, there's no need to be scared. They are just fish that live in the abyss. Even so, I'm still scared. Eve, but these fish have lights on them, so isn't that strange? They have lights because they live in the dark, and so they have to make their own light. It's called bioluminescence. Wow, I think those fish are so cool! Calm down, Mini Trucks. That's only a rock fish. He's hiding there so he won't be disturbed by the other fish. Well, between those that make their own light and those that turn into rocks, I'd say that these abyss fish are pretty aggressive. This time we found it! Wow! We finally made it! No wonder nobody was able to find it. Look how deep it had fallen. Bravo, Mini Trucks. Pirate Sam is going to be very pleased with you. Dear Mini Trucks, I have to congratulate you. With your teamwork, you have successfully found the lost treasure of Pirate Sam. Hooray! Because of your hard work, you have earned the Abyss Explorer Cup. Yeah! Well, at least you don't have to search for this one. <laughs> <laughs> ho, 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 Mini Trucks. That jelly you were eating must have been really tasty for you. It was the best that I've ever eaten. Oh, yeah? And uh, tell me what flavor was it? Raspberry! No, no, it was strawberry. I think it was blueberry. Um, actually, I don't really know. Lucky for all of you, I know exactly who can help you find out the flavor of that jelly. Let's head to truck control. Let's all roll for a brand new adventure! Yeah! Dear Mini Truck, your mission today is to find the mystery ingredient that made that jelly. It's a very interesting challenge for you today. And I will also equip you with mechanical arms and send you off to Chef Cookie. Hooray! Wow. Super! Wow. Four, three, two, one, Mini Truck, go! Hello, 
Hello there, mini trucks. Hello, Chef Cookie. I understand you're in search of an ingredient that's mysterious. Yep, it's so we can make jelly. And do you already know how to make jelly? Um, huh? not really, no. Well, it's basically some fruit and sugar that are cooked together slowly and for a long time. So if we find the fruit, does that mean we find its flavor? Exactly. Do you think you could describe it? That's easy. It was sweet and a bit tingly on the tongue. Very good. You will be looking for a sweet and sour fruit. You will most definitely find it in the forest. Here are some small baskets that you can use to collect oh. your pickings. You are going to have to taste what you are picking so you know what you're looking for. But be careful. Not everything has a pleasant mm -hmm. taste. Good luck, mini trucks. There's nothing here and nothing right here. And over here. Nope, still nothing. Huh? Well, let me see. There! Alex, hey, I have found something! Look Whoa. here! Let me taste! Mm -hmm. So then? It's so good! What you just tried is called mint. It's surprising because it tastes so fresh and so sweet. But don't you think it's sour? No, it hasn't got the flavor we're looking for, so we need to keep searching. Where can I find that ingredient? Oh, here it is! Yes, I think I found something! Hmm, let me see. So then... Yeah! Yeah! Are you okay? We overheard screaming. It's too bitter! Huh? Oh, yes, well, of course, it's a mushroom. I say it's better in an omelet than in jam. Oh, darn it. So we need to keep searching. <sighs> Ouch! What just hit me? Oh, those are chestnuts. You just need to remove the outside shell and the fruit is inside. Who wants to try? Not me! It does not tempt me. Okay, 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 then I'll try it. Mmm, that's so nice. It's smooth, a little sweet and bitter at the same time, but it's not the flavor we're looking for our jelly. Oh! This is it! Look, I found it! At last! It's exactly what we're looking for! Yes, this is sweet and a little sour! Yes, and they're red currants! Quick, let's fill up those baskets and bring them back to Chef Cookie! Ooh, goodness, what a fine harvest you've got there! Yes, and we found the flavor of that jelly! It was made with red currants! Super! Put it all into that pot! Jeremy, wait! But you had chestnuts in your basket! That will change the flavor of the jelly! No need to worry, Mini Trucks! Chestnuts are almost always excellent ingredients, even in a jam! Mmm! This is yummy! All right, Mini Trucks! I'm really curious if you have found the mystery ingredient of your jelly! Yes! They were red currants, and we even improved the recipe by adding chestnuts! Mmm, that sounds delicious! You have definitely won the 1,000 Flavor Cup! Woohoo! Do you guys know what flavor a cup has?